Do you know why circus stuntmen hold this long pole while walking on the tight rope? Or why use a long pole while cycling over this? Actually in such situations, this long pole helps to balance body weight. But how? Let's get deeper into the science. Every physical body has a center of mass at certain point. We can say the total mass of the body is concentrated at that point. Let's assume this stunt guy has the center of mass of point A. Total body weight is supported at these contacts between feet and rope. Let's assume at a moment body weight is balanced at point C. Let's call it support point or pivot point. To maintain balance, center of mass has to be in same vertical line with this pivot point. Earth gravitational force is acting downward on the physical body. Somehow, if the body position shifts slightly left or right, then the center of mass will also shift at that side. At this point, gravity will be acting on center of mass downward. So a torque will develop here. It will try to tilt the stuntman this side. Unfortunately the stuntman is going to lose balance and fall down. To balance on the tight rope, the stuntman has to shift the body to the other side quickly. To maintain balance, adjusting body position with infraction of second is necessary, and need to keep doing it while standing or walking on the tight rope. This is a quite impossible job for a human being. Probably you know this, while spinning if you bring your arms closer to your body, then you start spinning faster. Oppositely when you stretch out arms, your spinning slows down. This is because of changing moment of inertia, or rotational inertia. Arms are closer to the body means less rotational inertia, that means, with the same amount of rotational force, body will rotate faster. Arms stretched out means more rotational inertia, which means, same amount of force is not sufficient to spin the body at same speed. So spinning rate slows down. Here, the rotational inertia is very low, which works against unbalancing torque. But when stuntman stretches out arms, rotational inertia increases. Unbalancing torque effect slows down, so stuntman gets more reaction time to maintain balance. Now imagine, what will happen if you replace a much longer pole in place of stretched out arms? Answer is very simple, rotational inertia will be very high. That means the same amount of unbalancing torque will be less effective. So slight shifting of center of mass from vertical line will not make the body roll one side immediately. Thus, stuntman gets more reaction time to maintain balance. Also, this long pole both ends bends down due to its weight. This lowers the center of gravity and overall center of mass. When CG point much closer to the pivot point, it becomes much easier to balance on the tight rope. If you found this video helpful, then give it a like and share it with friends.